spacing of contraction joint spacing of contraction joint in rigid pavement rigid pavement contraction joint let us take this is two lane road these are expansion joints and in between expansion joints there will be contraction joints like this contraction joint like this This is expansion joint. These are contraction joints. This is longitudinal joint. <coughs> longitudinal joint. Suppose this is the spacing of contraction joint this is length of i mean spacing of contraction joint lc now if you see here This is LC. This is thickness of pavement, like this. So here, this is LC, and uh, this thickness is H. Width, let us take it is B. with this with the, the slab is b now due to weight <coughs> due to weight normal reaction will be there at bottom and uh, if it tries to contract towards like this if it tries to contract like this obviously frictional force will be produced at the bottom opposite to this that contraction like this frictional force so that frictional force equal to frictional force at bottom at bottom equal to coefficient of friction f into weight weight of slab that is if you take cross section like this so 50% that is lc by 2 each side lc by 2 so that equal to f is coefficient of long term friction so f into f equal to coefficient of friction coefficient of friction between between slab and 
5. So, f into weight of slab is b into h into Lc by 2 is the volume into gamma of concrete that is frictional force at bottom. Resisting area is it tries to because of this frictional force the slab the this frictional force on the slab is this much how much means that is uh, this is the slab means the frictional force will be here this one and uh, this one together it is frictional force F. It is tensile in nature. The frictional force is tensile in nature. Due to that frictional force, it should try to cut at the at center. Resisting section is resisting area equal to B into H. Resisting area equal to B into H. So tensile stress. Tensile stress equal to force by area that is F into BH into LC by 2 LC by 2 into gamma C divided by BH which is equal to F into LC into gamma C whole divided by 2 that is the tensile stress developed in the material allowable allowable tensile stress in concrete in concrete equal to SC stress in concrete. Therefore, SC equal to that is FLC gamma C by 2. F into LC into gamma C by 2. Therefore, LC equal to 2 times of SC by F into gamma C where gamma c equal to unit weight of concrete unit weight of concrete that is the length of contraction joint uh, spacing of contraction joint lc spacing of contraction joint, spacing of joint spacing of joint contraction joint lc equal to that much 